go. Welcome back to Great Day Live, live from the Hardin County Fair. Now we're going to turn our attention to always a fan favorite, the tractor and the truck pull. But new this year, there is the Mid-South Pullers Association Tractor and Truck Pull. That is coming up uh, later this week. Actually, on Saturday, I'm with uh, Brandon and Brian to kind of talk us through everything that's going to happen there. But, I mean, this is going to be, thanks for being here, by the way, first of all, in this nice, hot, steamy Wednesday morning, right? Yep. Yeah, you know? no, it's it's always great, and fair time is, is a wonderful time. The county loves it, and everybody has a great time here. So we're, we're looking forward to the rest of the week, especially tonight and Saturday night. So we'll have a great uh, action-packed event uh, coming for the tractor truck and tractor pull. So I uh, really look forward to that. Right. Well, I have to tell everybody, we actually interviewed Brandon as part of one of our Hometown Proud shows. I feel like this is like a Hometown Proud reunion. Yeah. You and your wife own Phillips uh, Grove. Yep. Beautiful wedding venue in there. How are you all doing down there, by the way? It's doing great. And uh, so it, it's, it's really amazing to see kind of all the county uh, involvement and everyone there and then you come here and you're like hey you got married over there so it's <laughs> it's all it ties it all together so it is it's it's uh, it's a lot of fun what do you think that it is about a tractor or a truck truck pool that pulls people together generation after generation it never seems to lose interest uh, especially here in Hardin County why is it important I, I think the amount of um, agriculture in the rural area that we have here in the county and just the support from all the farmers and uh, local involvement I mean we just our farmers are great and we got to have farmers everyone likes to eat and uh I mean, it's just a great time. It's a family event. Everybody has a great time with it. Um, and as you said, the generations, I mean, yeah. my dad brought me to a tractor pull when I was, you know, very, very young. And then, of course, I have a son now and I'm bringing him to tractor pull. So it's, it is it's generation after generation. And so we just try to keep it going. So with the big show that's coming up on Saturday, it is just over behind us here. You have like a full track, like I'm a mom, I'm a planner. So explain to me, like, what are they trying to do? If I've ne people have never been before, what is the object yep. of the tractor pool? Where are we going from A to B? Sure. Okay. Yep. So as we get everyone in here, we'll get them all staged back in the back. They got to go through a tech inspection. So every vehicle has to pass a tech inspection. Once they pass, that goes to start time. Once we get up to start time, um, what the the object of the game is to pull the sled as far as you can. So speed is is not a factor here at all. It's the distance. So as they pull, um, first through last place is ranked by distance. So um, and you have different classes. So you have tractor classes, truck classes, and and in those classes you actually have different tractor classes. And I mean it's um, it's a very substantial event and uh, it's a great thing that. Um, uh, that is coming here Saturday. Right. And I know everybody out there is like, oh, I didn't know that either. I'm just saying I'm asking for everybody. And you talked a lot about the dirt. The dirt yep. is so important, Brian. That's why I got to come over to you, because uh, if, if they're pulling it that distance, you've had to do some stuff this week to make sure that the dirt is ready for this. That, that's right. The dirt is very important to it and uh, it takes a special blend. And there's also additives we can put in with it, it even comes from your but your washing machine. Right. Uh, I had Tide laundry detergent of all things. How much Tide did you use over well, there? Well, I'll use, I'll use, it's ex kind of expensive. I'll use yeah. a full box per right. thousand gallons and it actually helps keep the moisture in the track. Is that right? And so it just makes the, the ground a little bit more movable it, and? It makes it movable and it keeps, it actually holds the moisture in it. I did not know that. Well. Right. Now I do. Well, and uh, thanks to Dan Christiani and a lot of people like Larry Phillips, I, you know, a lot of these other guys don't think we're watching them, but but we are as we're, as we're yeah. young boys. See all the hacks and tips and tricks here on Great Day Live. Um, anything else you want people to know about times, tickets, and, and, and where to go for all that? Sure. Uh, so just kind of tractor pull related. Um, start time is five o'clock or six. Uh, on Saturday. On yeah. Saturday. Yeah. Yep. Actually, we're going to open the gate. We're going to open the gates. 8:30. Yep. Uh, the mission on the on the gates open 8:30 is eight dollars, and until 4:30, and 4:30 goes to 12 as we go into the pro pulling league mid south. All right, and that's such a big deal. I, I wanted to touch on that too because it is such a big deal to have. How did you get that here at the Hardin County Fair? Well, over the years we finally advanced up and making a bigger show for our county. We have a, such a large support from Hardin County. Yeah. 
Uh, as you can look around, there's banners everywhere, everywhere. Large, large support, and we can't do it without the support of our county. Yeah, you. there are, just looking around here, you see the names of the businesses that are behind the Hardin County Fair. It's a lot of, you know, local mom and pop, and that's what you guys are all about. It's like supporting local business here. Yep, yeah, so be sure to come out tonight, the rest of the week, Saturday night for sure. It's going to be a great day. Don't let the weather affect anything. Don't let the weather come out, support a great event, and uh, look forward to a great time. And go back in the pits, meet all the pullers. Have oh, you can do that. Yes, That's you great. can. Yeah, so there's there's no additional cost to go back in the pits and talk to all the pullers. You can go back there, talk to them, have them autograph, sign anything you want. So it's, uh, it's a great time, and the kids love it. So. Hey, before we head off to break, you want to tell us what we have here behind us? Yeah, so behind us here, we have a uh, light. Yep. A, it's called a light limited super stock. Yeah. This one is currently alcohol. Uh, in this class, you can have alcohol or diesel. So um, this one runs tonight with the KTPA, and uh, we look forward to a great event tonight. We'll be back Saturday with uh, two more tractors to run the Mid-South Pro Pulling League. All right, Brandon and Brian, thank you guys so You're much. Welcome. Say hi to Victoria for us. Will do. We have to get back out there pretty soon to that venue. It's beautiful. All right, so now you know all about the tractor pull and how it works. Yeah, I learned even a couple of hacks there. So stay with us, and if you want a full list of events, all you have to do is go over to HardenCOFair.com. Uh, stay with us. More Great Day Live after the break. We're going to head over to food next.